So now that we're all sheltering in place, I decided to go out for a walk with Penny. As I started looking around the ground, I started noticing all these beautiful rocks and stones. So I started picking up a few of them and noticed other stones around them. I got my sifter out, I started digging around, brought them back to the van, cleaned them up, and this is what I found. Let's take a look. Now all these rocks, and some of these are fossils as you can see, were all found within a four square foot radius of each other. Like somebody dumped them there, left them, maybe they were rock hounding, maybe I have no idea why they left them. But either way, they're totally cool. Now of all these stones that I found, I have to say I am the happiest with these fossils. It is incredible to think that you're holding something in your hand that was alive millions of years ago. Millions. <laughs> it's just, it's mind boggling to think that like this was in the water millions and millions of years ago before man ever even walked on the earth. It's incredible. Now, I am not an expert on fossils by any means, and I am not a gemologist or a geologist or any of the ologies above. Well, I am a cosmetologist, but I guess that doesn't count, right? So I did my best to add names to a lot of these that I saw based on information that I could find on the internet from many, many different sites because I haven't found one site out there that has all of the minerals and everything listed. Some of them have the names but no pictures and it would take me 20 years to go through every one of them to try to match them up. So I was trying to learn about their um, cleavage and how they break their basic structure. So if some of them are wrong or some of them don't have names on them, I wasn't really sure because there's so many of them out there that look alike, that have a lot of the same properties. So if you know or recognize any of these stones right off, um, please, please, please leave them in the comments below. I would love to learn. Um, right now I'm having a difficult time because our local university does stone identification and I would have taken these all in and let them identify every one of them at the geology department at the university. Since we are in a pandemic at the moment, everything's closed and no one is around, so... We'll do this later. But anyhow, if there's anybody that like knows exactly what these are or if I got some of them incorrect, I apologize. Please write it in the comments. I appreciate it. I hope you enjoy looking at all of these as much as I did.